Hey guys, welcome back. So I got a request to do a tutorial on how to control a line trace in a 2D side scroller with a joystick and thought I would share with you guys the solution I came up with. Hopefully this is helpful to the person that requested it and anybody else that may come across this tutorial. Alright, so let's get started. I opened up the 2D side scroller template from Unreal and what we're going to be doing, so I'm going to delete all of this stuff, we'll make this together. Um, first thing I did was I added a billboard to the player. And what I'm going to do with this billboard is actually use it as a rotation point for the line trace. So I'm going to come here into the event graph and off of our event tick, I'm going to say line trace by channel and I'm gonna drag out our beam billboard that I made and we'll get the world location and we're gonna find the forward vector so we always know the direction that this line trace should be facing and since this is a unit vector, it means it has a length of 1, it's not going to be very long. So we're going to multiply this by a float, and we'll say about 500. And this will give us a longer vector that we can now add to the world location of the beam. So add these two vectors together. And this is where we're going to want our line trace to end. We'll basically be like 500 units in front of the player. And it's going to start at the world location of this beam. And I'm going to have this line trace just show for a certain duration so that we can see what we're doing. And the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this beam, this little billboard here, and I want to set the world rotation. So this is how I'm going to actually change the direction that the beam is facing. And if we right click here on rotation, we can split the structure pin. And we're going to need two of these. So we'll control C, control V. And we're going to right click here and say, um, X or Y axis gamepad. So left thumbstick y-axis just because that's what the default um, virtual joystick is. It's the left thumbstick. And we're going to be using this axis value to actually change the pitch of our um, little billboard here. So hook that up like this. Now these axis values go between 0 and 1. So what we actually want is the inverse sign in degrees. And then we're going to use this boolean here um, that tells us whether the character is moving left or right. And we're going to hook that up to a branch because rotation in Unreal only goes between 0 and 180 so when the player switches directions that he's moving we're going to need to switch up um, our rotation, but we're going to need to do a little bit of funky math to get it to work out because you can't, Unreal doesn't let you rotate in uh, 360 degrees. So we're going to hook this up to the true and this one up to the false. Now for the true, we can just plug this directly into the pitch, but for the false, what we're going to need to do is first multiply this by a float. We want to multiply it by negative 1. Because remember, this is going to be um, the gamepad goes negative 1 to positive 1. So when we switch directions, like when we're facing left, these values coming out are going to be negative, even though the player's forward direction, which we're using here, is always going to be positive. So that's why we have to do this negative 1 here. 
and then the other funky part is we're going to subtract 180 from this value coming in here. And that just gets the rotation to flip in the proper direction. And let me look at my cheat sheet over here. I think that might be it. Yep. So if we compile and save this, and we hit play, now we can see we can actually rotate this in 360 degrees based on which direction the player is facing. Um, it's not perfect as you can see up here at the top it kind of gets stuck. There's a lot of value up here that's uh, the computer's thinking this is all 90 degrees. I'm hoping that on a real uh, joystick it'll be a little bit more sensitive but you do get the intermediate angles pretty good on this in both directions. So. Alright guys, I hope that was helpful, especially to the person that requested this, and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Alright, see you guys later.